Hey, welcome back. So we're working on a Mazda CX-5. It's a 2022. I want to see if it's going to get hit with that um, pin code thing. I did a video on that before I had to use a D1 form, but I want to see if I can go the other route and go through the Mazda website and pay more, but less paperwork. So let's go ahead and see. Some of the Mazdas I noticed, they're like hit or miss if you need to do the pin code or if it's automatically with the Smart Pro. Not quite sure. Uh, check out the YouTube channel, Advanced Diagnostics. They cover that on what to do. I'll put the links below. Very helpful. Okay, so one, two, three, four buttons. And one, two, three, four buttons. Okay. Okay, let's press it. Does it, it turns orange? Yes. And we switch it on. Yes. Let's see, let's bypass security, yes to bypass. And let's see. Okay, so failed. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the Mazda website and we're gonna create account. We're not gonna do a NASA D1 form, we're gonna do the basic one in case you don't have that for some of the people in the org. Let's get started. Okay, so we went through the Mazda website. We updated and created a basic um, access. It cost me 50 bucks. Um, the, the video when they made this it said 35, now it's 50. Uh, that's the price you pay for doing these expensive keys, I guess. Cool, so we have the VIN number. We're gonna get this information from the Smart Pro. Let's go ahead and proceed. So we're gonna go back, no. Let's do add keys, same configuration. Let's turn it off and it turns orange, yes. And it turns on. Okay. Um, no, we can't bypass it. Let's, let's hit no, we have two keys. So we're gonna get this information now. So we have part number. And we have P. X four three dash one. Okay, and submit. Let me check my email. So you just see this, it says 15 minutes will be processed. Um, I did this other time with the D1 form. It was instant. Um, interesting, okay, cool. So there's two different ways to do this. A uh, fast way and a slow way. Okay, welcome back. It's been about 11 minutes and I got the email. I took a picture and I have it on my tablet. So I got that information. And let's go ahead and continue. So let's enter the encode. Encode is gonna be... Seven. There we go, geez. So encode 784A, 784A, okay. Oh, geez. Okay, cool, I'm just gonna wait another 10 minutes for it to horn, hunk. Technically it's seven minutes. And again, we'll use the push start and we'll finish that. Cool, so hopefully this video will help uh, if you have the D1 access or if you don't and we can problem solve. Now, I guess the advantage is looking at with Mazda and looking at like how TIS works. So if you line up multiple Mazdas to get them all done, you have access for that 24 hour window. So you can do, you know, 50 bucks and you can do like three Mazdas in one day or in that time frame. So you schedule those appointments and you can crank through all of them and then you'll save money, you'll maximize your time and effort. And that's a cool thing. Same thing with Toyota. So that's something I learned recently to just maximize your subscriptions and go that way. Cool, we'll come back when this beeps.